guys. Uh, since uh, last week, I'm uh, very busy with the uh, technical analysis of the Bitcoin now. Uh, since my uh, last uh, previous weeks, my analysis for the uh, gold is uh, gold will experience bias a trend in the higher time frame. Okay, we will uh, make some uh, uh, updates of the gold. Okay, we will start uh, from the higher time frame, which is monthly. Okay, based on my previous analysis, the prices of the higher time frame created a pennant uh, shape. As I've said that, the pinan ship is about to complete about 85%, meaning uh, the volume of the trades, either the buyers and the seller is not ideal to trade. Since the uh, pennan is about to complete, I will make some top-down analysis. We will start from the monthly and weekly. If you will observe, this is the pattern of the uh, pennan ship, wherein in the weekly time frame, the momentum is still on the still on the uh, bearish trend, but it is about almost uh, one fourth of the out of one hundred. If we a hundred percent is already uh, seventy percent completed, then the remaining thirty percent is the. If you want to trace bias, the, the bearish uh, trend, it's uh, already 25-30%. So it's not ideal because the volume of the trend is not ideal to trade. For me, based on the uh, top-down analysis, if we check the daily time frame. So the, the current prices is uh, sitting, again, sitting on the strong support. But... As you can see, the daily, on the daily bias of the gold is still on the bearish, but it is a uh, remaining of 30% subset. So anytime it will bounce back and then uh, if you will trend a uh, bearish uh, trend or trend, you will be... Uh, If there is a sudden uh, bounce of prices, it's very hard for you to recover. So it's better to, for me, huh? I will not trade gold at this time because of the uh, situation. I will, I will take off. This is the strong, uh, this is the support, and this is also a strong resistance. There are lots of buyers or sellers position their trade above. So this in the daily, this is the strong resistance above there. So support and resistance. If you will check, if you will trade in the lower time frame, the word the reward is not ideal to trade because of the very small gap. You will be trapped with that. So if you will uh, trade on the bullish yeah they will that this is the only the gap the reward that you will be uh, it, it's not ideal every time when the prices uh swiftly uh, move upward and again it will drop if you also try trend on the bearish your tape profit is not uh, ideal because there is a strong support below that line so this is the uh, this is the strong resistance above. This is strong resistance, and this is also a strong support. So you will only trade on this one. We will wait when this strong support or resistance will be broken, and then again position the price before we'll engage in trading. Okay, as of now, I will not recommend to trade this gold because we will wait for this higher time frame. Uh, pen and ship to complete this is in the monthly we will have to complete this one if this uh this uh trend lines which is also a resistance will be broken and again this support 
below will be broken and we will wait if this support will be broken this is the next level that you have to watch out this is the next level of support until here but if the when this uh, shape will be completed and this there is a breakout on the uh, resistance then we will position and it will when the it will make a higher high and then the resistance will become a support that's the time that you will trade on the bullish plan and if it will reverse the bullish and this is the next price of the higher time frame wherein you will set your take profit this is the strong level of resistance and this is the must be broken first before the goal that's why the fundamentals say that you have to it's time to invest in gold but as of now there is no indication that i will position my trade to engage in full blast uh, uh investment of gold i will wait when this uh shape will be completed before i will uh, finalize i will make some decision to trade either buy bullish or bear so as, as you can see we will make a recap this is about to complete the shape so we will have to wait the shape to be broken and then position the prices before you can see that it's about it's the time that we will invest gold okay guys as of now uh i will uh this is the latest update of the gold and if you have concern you have any question just uh, uh, make some uh, questions in my channel and then I will ask through my website okay so that's all for gold uh, that's all for gold